Nowadays, everyone want to buy a 5G phone with high refresh rate, but it's difficult to find a 5G phone with 120 Hz refresh rate just in 10,000 rupees. If you want to buy this type of phone, then this video is for you. At number 1, Moto G45. Smartphone has 6.5 inches IPS display with 120 Hz refresh rate and FHD resolution with 405 pixel density. Phone has 580 nits peak brightens, which is not much high. Display is protected with Gorilla Glass 3 on front. Phone has side mounted fingerprint sensor, which is very responsive, and also has IP52 certification for dust and splash protection. All vegan leather finish make it very premium. On right side, you will get volume rocker and power button. On top side, phone has microphone and Dolby branding. On downside, phone has 3.5 mm audio jack, microphone, USB Type-C and speaker grill with dual stereo speakers. Phone comes with Snapdragon CXS Gen 3 chipset. But remember, this is not high performance device. But still you can play Call of Duty at very high setting, not on max. And then two to score is 4 lakh plus. On camera side, Phone has 50 megapixel main camera, including 2 megapixel macro lens. Camera quality is good. Photos comes out in good colors and detail. Image quality is not excellent, but you can say this one has good camera with respect to its price. Colors looks natural and not over sharp. You can record FHD video at 30 FPS because of a CXS Gen 3. On front, phone has 16 megapixel selfie shooter. Phone runs Hello UI based on Android 14. Phone packed with 8GB of RAM and 128GB of storage. Company provides you 1-year OS and 3-year security updates. Phone has 5000 mAh battery 20W charge. At number 2, Poco M6 Pro. The phone has 6.79 inches IPS display. 90Hz refresh rate and touch sampling rate is 240Hz which make it smooth. Full HD display and 396 ppi provides excellent color scheme. 550 nits brightness is good for outdoor visibility. Premium blast back in this segment make it attractive. The weight is 199 gram weight is slightly heavy. IP53 rating protect phone from dust and splashes. Microphone USB type C speaker grill SIM card tray and 3.5 mm jack and IR blaster. Sides are flat and 8.2 mm thick. The side-mounted fingerprint is not very quick. Segment first 4 Gen 2 processor provides you excellent gaming experience. Euro works good. Performance is outstanding on the behalf of and 2 2 and Geekbench score. 50 megapixel main camera provides good photography and decent colors. You can shoot FHD video at 30 FPS. There is no EIS and OIS support. No stabilization in video. 8 megapixel selfie shooter. This runs MIUI 14 based on Android 13 and company provides you 2 years major and 3 years security updates. Connectivity options are good. 5000 mAh battery and 18 watt charger. At number 3, Moto G34. This is Moto G34 5G. The phone has 6.5 inches IPS display with 120 Hz refresh rate and an offering a panda glass protection. Phone has HD in 270 ppi display with 580 nits peak brightens. Vegan leather back with Dolby Atmos stereo speaker system. Phone has a weight of 180 gram with IP52 rating, which protect from dust and splashes. Phone is made of plastic with 8 mm thickness and built-in fingerprint sensor. 5G enable with Snapdragon 695 processor. Improved gaming experience with good Anchu and Geekbench score. You can consider this phone for gaming purpose in TIS price segment. 50 megapixel dual camera. The camera capture very decent photos and video in daylight condition. Colors are very good and deep. Night photography is not much bad. These are some samples of night shots. You can record max FHD video at 30 frames per seconds. There is no OIS support. 16 megapixel selfie camera. Phone runs Android 14 with 4 GB RAM and 128 GB of storage. 5000 mAh battery with 20 watt charge.
at number 4 in Finex Hot 55G. This could be the most premium and powerful smartphone in this segment with beautiful and slim design. Smartphone has 6.7-inch IPS panel with 120Hz fast refresh rate and 240Hz touch sampling rate. This is only HD display with 262 pixel density, offering 500 nits peak brightness with dynamic bar feature. Company claimed the five years of assured fluency. Hot 50 launched in three different colors and hand feel looks amazing. Also featured IP54 water rating. Here is 3.5 mm audio jack, microphone, USB type C and speaker grill. Phone has power button which also work as fingerprint sensor and volume rocker, nothing on top, on left side phone has SIM tray, phone comes with Dimensity 6300 chipset, with 4 lakh Antutta benchmark, very powerful chip in this segment, the gaming is really smooth, even you can play BGMI at 40 FPS, which is really good, 48 megapixel dual rear camera, with 8 megapixel selfie shooter, talking about the camera, the image quality, is really outstanding with respect to price. Color tone is so good in daylight in Finex Hot 50, enable you to zoom up to 5x, you can get nice detail while zooming, also support sky shop feature. So you can change the background weather, you can record max FHD video at 30 frame per seconds. Video quality is not very stable, but colors are so good. It runs XOS 14, based on Android 14, and pack it with 8GB of RAM, with 128GB of storage, Hot 50 will get 2 years of security updates, powered by 5000mAh battery, with 18W charger. At number 5, Lava Blaze 3. This is Lava Blaze 3 5G as smartphone comes with 6.56 inches IPS panel, with 90Hz fast refresh rate. Unfortunately, this is not FHD panel, and the pixel density is 267 ppi, very brilliant colors, comes out, even in HD resolution and low ppi. So you can say, this one has, good quality display, nits are not much high, but enough, to use in outdoor condition, beautiful glass back design, with 201 gram weight, which looks heavy. Thickness of the phone is 8.6 millimeters which looks slim in this price range, you can get side-mounted fingerprint sensor and face unlock feature to fulfill security needs. Phone comes with Dimensity 6300 chipset. I think this is very good choice. In this price segment, gaming experience is so good, I did not feel lagging issues. And the Antutu score goes up to 4 lakh. Segment first phone, offering vibe light feature, with 50 megapixel main camera, along with 2 megapixel depth sensor. Looks like a flagship level feature, according to the price, camera quality is outstanding, very decent photos comes out, that are very close to the natural color, enable you to capture, good detail images, in daylight condition, it can balance, dynamic range in good way, close photos, provides good colors, and detail in depth, even night photography is also satisfactory, you can record, max 2K video, at the rate of 30 FPS, video quality is so good, but lack of stability. On front, phone has, 8 megapixel selfie shooter, it runs, Android 14, and packed with, 6GB of RAM, with 128GB of storage, phone is powered by, 5000mAh battery, with 18W charger.